840, I've got Patty Spittler here with a really great story. She's got one of her lovers here, one of your, your fluffy um, actual house guests who lives with you, <laughs> one of you full on your cat here, but she has an amazing backstory. And yes. it might answer some questions for folks at home who have who have those questions about feral cats or wild cats or just neighborhood cats and how to handle it. Feral means they could have been abandoned or they could have been born in the wild. Mm -hmm. She was 15 years ago. Um, I, you know, everybody comes to my door, patio feed us, so I fed her. <laughs> and then it was in the middle of winter and she's real tiny and I thought, she's just a kitten. And then <sighs> she disappeared and about a month later she came back with three kittens behind her. Oh, so I trapped her again, got the kittens adopted, uh -huh. uh, had her spayed, put her back out, she got in a fight, she lost an eye. Aww. So I trapped her again, brought her in, and took her to the vet and got, I had to get her teeth down and, and her front claws filed because she was, she was, now, and the, you, you know what else? You didn't remove them, you just got them filed. Yeah, well, I did, I have them removed okay. in the front. Back she has, she okay. has the back. She is inside now for the last 15 years. Yeah. I could leave the door open 24 seven, she would not go out, but I don't think she likes the light. So She's you keep talking a little bit and, and I'm we'll gonna see. see if I can get mommy kitty out here, Well, cause okay? this is a serious uh, point and I wanna bring this up too because um, my grandmother lives in Howard County in Kokomo and she loves cats and will take care of all kinds oh, of I've cats. Oh, I've always had cats too. In her community, you know, because your heart just, you see them, especially out in the cold and the outside. So she'll put food out, uh, but then also shelter's a big thing too. Shelter, to take care that's of what we have down here. She doesn't want to She's go. She's like, no, it's scary. Tell me her name, Patty. Mommy Kitty. Oh, she's called she had, Mommy Kitty. I, oh, I, okay. <laughs> now, she didn't want to go in, now she doesn't want to go in. A little, oh, little camera come. shy. Come on, Kitty Kitty. She's a here black we go. kitty, and as you mentioned. You pull, yeah, you pull. As you mentioned, there we she go. is missing one of her There eyes. we go. Oh, so she's girl. tiny, and she, she has one small. eye. And she but had kittens, you said, very, very young, because very, cats can very. have them very young. Okay, that's one thing. Now, if you have outside, look, you point down there. Take the top off from that. I'm going to hold on to her. One? She's doing really well, though. Put some uh, hay in there, not straw. And this is I'm like sorry, a cooler, straw, not hay, it? because it'll, it'll absorb. You don't want to put blankets in there either or a pillow. Look at that, see? So and they'll go like in there. This is outdoor home here. Cut a hole in the front put a brick on top of it and they'll go in. You can get two or three in there. Yeah. Uh, and also when you see that their ears are tipped, you know what that means. That they've been spayed or neutered. They've been spayed or neutered. Right. They can live in a colony called Clowder and you can, you know, help them, feed them a little bit. And they're excellent for mousers, for, you know, and so moles and things thing like that. They'll take, take care, care of, of your local neighborhood mouser. Give them somewhere to sleep safe at night because that is a problem. We'll do have Feral cats who will yeah. just die in the cold, you know. And if they're doing you a service and they're helping you they're with your, you a service. their mouse or your, you know what I mean, your moles or whatever is in your area, then you can just grab one of these. Uh, yeah, yeah, and you, or you floors. can use a plastic thing too, a, like, like plastic things that you buy stuff. She's doing really, really well. I'm yeah. very proud of her. Good for her. Um, and just put a brick on top of it so it won't blow away, and they'll be then they'll be just fine. Yeah. So, uh, but they are good at mousers. The other thing they're good at is procreating. So make sure you get them <laughs> spayed or neutered. Look and how well so she's And there's so many ways doing. to do that too without being very costly or painful no, uh, animals. Oh, 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 thank you. Uh, Facespayneuter.org <laughs> if you go there or is it .com? I can't see on the... I don't see it on there. Oh wait, Mar Marcus has it. Org. 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 Okay, fake, <laughs> that makes sense. too far for me too, Patty. You're not alone. <laughs> Gotta get my other cataract fixed. Uh, uh, Facebook.org, mm -hmm. and there's a, at the top of the page it says Community Cats. Okay. If you hit on that link. Also, we have a couple of pictures I think you saw earlier. She gets along great with the dogs. They know that she's, look, here's oh. all three of them out there. There, There's Mommy, and there she is because I feed her on top of the counter. It's Lucky okay. <laughs> it's it's my it's house, house. house. I can rule. feed her anywhere I want, <laughs> but uh, so that the dogs don't get her food. But she gets along. She loves Stewie, of right. course. Well, and we're looking forward to Pet Pals TV. That's today. Today, and we've got a cat. Speaking of cats, we have. She's doing so good. She has a, a cat that was caught in a fire and explosion in the house. Oh, wow. The woman lost everything. The cat disappeared and she thought, well, you know. That's it. But a few months later, they found the cat. Oh, what They're a very resilient. Very, we should all be like cats. They're survivors. They're oh, survivors. I love it. Patty, thanks for coming in. Thanks for bringing Mommy Kitty. You did a great job, girly. Oh, 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 oh. okay. We're going to go back in now. <laughs> She's like, oh, now you're talking to me. I have to be nervous. All right, Marcus, you go ahead and take it. You're not camera shy. No, no. Take it away. 845.